Hey there, DIY enthusiasts and tech tinkerers. Whether you're repairing electronics, working on circuit boards, or tackling creative DIY projects, having the right soldering iron can make all the difference. Today, we're diving into the top five best soldering irons. But before we get started, make sure to check the link in the description below if you want to know about the price and other information. Let's get started. Kicking off our list at number five is the Hako FX951 soldering station. The Hako FX951 soldering station is like a pizza delivery in that it's always hot and ready, making it a perfect choice for professionals looking for a unit with quick temperature recovery. After soldering, the iron cools down but takes only a few seconds to get back up to your working temperature. Hako units are known for heating up quickly between jobs, allowing people to get more work done in a shorter time span. We actually had two electronics experts pick the Hako FX888D, but it has since been discontinued. The Hako FX951 has many of the same features, plus a few more that could be useful for professionals and hobbyists. The ceramic tips allow for rapid heat conduction, and the temperature can be easily selected using the arrows on the station. On top of having a 30-minute automatic shutoff, there's a low temperature alarm, temperature stability of plus or minus 9 degrees F, and a lockout key card to set the temperature at a specific level. For anyone using this in a work setting, you'll be happy to know that it meets or exceeds the industry safety standards for soldering irons. Coming in at number four is the Weller Digital Soldering Station. The Weller Digital Soldering Station is a lightweight and compact workstation that gives you complete control. Using the arrows and menu buttons, you can set the temperature between 200 and 850 degrees F and lock it at your desired setting, where it will remain at plus or minus 10 degrees F, which allows for more consistency. The station has password protection to keep your settings the way you like them a standby mode that can be set from 1 to 99 minutes, and an auto setback feature that turns the iron to a preset temperature when it's not in use to prevent energy usage and tip damage. There's also a locking feature you can turn on to keep children or other unauthorized users from accidentally turning it on. Unlike other soldering stations we researched, this one has a detachable iron for easy storage. It does have one of the slower heat up times of any unit we researched, 28 seconds to go from 120 to 660 degrees F, but it has a stable base and is made with electrostatic discharge safe materials. You won't get a brass cleaner or cleaning flux, though it does have a wet sponge tray and safety rest. At number three, we have the Buckon 969S Soldering Iron Kit. The Buckon 969S Soldering Iron Kit comes with an intuitive LED station that controls all aspects of the soldering iron and lets you know if there's anything wrong with it, eliminating any guesswork for soldering novices. The screen tells the user if there's a heating element or sensor issue, allowing them to address the issue and get back to soldering. Beginners will appreciate the anti-static design that prevents damage to circuit boards or other electronics. Other irons can sometimes emit static electricity while in use, which can cause damage to electrical components or the machine itself. Accessories such as interchangeable tips, soldering wire, brass cleaner, a solder sucker for cleanup, and tweezers for holding tiny parts can help in beginning one's soldering journey. The temperature, which ranges from 356 to 896 degrees F, is set using up and down arrows on the station and there's a 20 second heat up time to reach the maximum setting. You can toggle the display between Fahrenheit and Celsius, set a password lock to save your preferred heat levels, and set the sleep mode to anywhere between 1 and 60 minutes. Coming in at number 2 is the Qming Soldering Iron Kit. At under $20, the Qming Soldering Iron Kit is a perfect fit for people who need an affordable soldering iron that doesn't compromise on quality. Let's start with the fact that you get five soldering tips, something that irons three times more expensive don't offer, so you can tackle a variety of jobs with the same unit. There's also the high temperature range, 392 to 842 degrees F, and a 15 second heat up time. There's no temperature readout, so you'll have to trust that the tip is at the temperature selected on the adjustable dial. 
On the bright side, you have a high temperature silicone sleeve to protect your hands from the heat and four ventilation holes for rapid cooling. Along with the soldering wire, you'll get a stand to prevent the hot tips from scalding your table or workbench, a flux cleaner, and a wet sponge tray to clean impurities from your tip. The budget-friendly price means you won't get special features like automatic shut-off or sleep mode. Instead, you'll have to remember to turn it off by flipping the switch on the handle if you plan on stepping away for a few minutes. The work indicator light turns from red to white when it's ready to be used again. Finally, at number one is the Xtronic 3020 XTS soldering station. The Xtronic 3020 XTS soldering station is our pick for the best overall because it comes with everything you'd want in a soldering station at a great price point. It has an adjustable thermometer dial that goes from 194 to 896 degrees Fahrenheit, a digital LED temperature display, a 10-minute sleep timer to prevent overheating and energy waste, and a flexible 40-inch iron cord that allows you to reach into tight spaces with ease. The station comes with two detachable helper hands that can be used to hold smaller components, like a circuit board, while you solder. You also won't need to buy any extra supplies, except for specialty or replacement tips, since it comes with a roll of solder wire, a wet and brass sponge for cleaning and maintenance, and a small tin of cleaning flux. You can trust the iron is at the temperature you selected because it uses proportional integral derivative, a high-tech algorithm that adjusts the heat output based on the difference between the selected and actual temperature of the iron. The entire unit weighs under two pounds, so it might budge if you move the wire too much. Speaking of which, the iron itself is permanently attached to the station which can make storage a little challenging compared to irons that detach from their station. Wrapping it around the unit could damage the cord. And there you have it, our top five soldering irons. Be sure to check the links in the description below for the latest prices and availability. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more tips and reviews. Happy soldering.